iPad 5 LCD screen and touchscreen digitizer repair. Warning, you're performing this repair at your own risk. We claim no responsibility for any damages that might occur. To perform this DIY repair, you'll need a plastic triangle opening tool, nylon spudger, fine tip curved tweezers, precision knife set, premium two millimeter red adhesive roll, multi-purpose heat gun, Phillips screwdriver, Power down your 9.7 inch Apple iPad 5 tablet. The iPad 5 touchscreen digitizer is glued on solidly and is a tight fit within the rear case. Apply heat to soften the adhesive beneath the glass. Use a precision knife to create enough space to insert a triangle opening tool. With the triangle opening tool, slice through the sticky adhesive and decouple the iPad 5 digitizer. Be careful not to cut or damage any of the display cables. Do not try to fully separate the touchscreen yet, as several fragile ribbon cables still connected to the iPad's logic board. Once the adhesive has been separated, open the digitizer like a page in a book and rest it on your workspace. Remove all tape obscuring the LCD screws. Extricate the following four Phillips screws. Grab the LCD and lift it out of its recess. Be gentle and keep an eye on the LCD cable. Remove the following three Phillips screws from the display cable bracket. Pry the display cable bracket straight up from the logic board and remove the iPad 5 LCD. Remove the small piece of tape covering the home button ribbon cable connector. Use the flat end of a spudger to flip the tab on the home button ribbon cable ZIF connector upward. Pull the home button ribbon cable straight out of the ZIF connector. With a spudger in hand, carefully pop the two digitizer cable connectors straight up from their sockets. Remove the iPad 5 touchscreen digitizer. Use the tweezers to free part of the home button ribbon cable from the adhesive securing it to the bracket. The bracket that secures the iPad 5 home button and touch ID is held in place with two gobs of adhesive. Use the spudger to pry it up from the front panel. Spudge up and remove the iPad 5 home button and touch ID assembly.
All the replacement parts and repair tools used in the video are available at www.fixeasy.com. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, like us on Facebook, and follow us on Twitter. Make sure to take a look at our other DIY smartphone and tablet repair tutorials.